Hi, I'm Chris Hubbard. Join me while we tackle stigma for mental health. Join me in September for I'm Listening. When I first uh, got here, um, I was struggling bad because of the whole big change from coming from Pittsburgh. I was in Pittsburgh for five years, um, signing a new deal. I never seen that uh, amount of money um, coming where I'm from. I'm from, you know, like I mentioned before, I'm from Columbus, Georgia. Uh, my family didn't have that much money, you know what I mean? Seeing that much money, it was like, um, it was very, I was happy and sad at the same time because of everybody knows what's going on. Everybody sees this and it's a lot of weight on my shoulders because I, you feel like you have to take care of so many people back home or you have to take care of so many people that's like, that's been in your corner. Well, uh, truth of the matter is like, you have to take care of yourself first before you can help somebody else. You know what I mean? So that's one of those things that um, that I dealt with coming here. But um, the, like I said, I, the team helped me out. I think um, the awareness part of it is uh, based on like our peers. We're, we're afraid to say that something's going on. Um, you're afraid of what they might say behind closed doors. You're afraid of um, what people, what other people might say. You, you know what I mean? Those are some of the things that you worry about and go through in your head and um, that causes another mental stress as well because you're so afraid of what people might say that adds more and more stress on your body and um, physically mentally and emotionally you know um, I've dealt with those things but I'm like man it's time to like save other people as well and um, you know just being that that public role model uh, people will, will get the idea of like what's going on and then start you know looking into it and researching more about it and you know maybe they can get help uh, my advice to anyone that's struggling with anything um depression anxiety uh emotionally anything like that i, I just would say to them that you know you're not alone that um you can seek help at any time um, don't wait till it's too late before you get yourself down deep in a depression that you can't get yourself out of um, you, you know, um, depend on your family, you know, your family is always there to listen to you and to really like, um, to just, just be that open ear that you might need to hear at that time. They don't have to say anything, but what you could get off your chest is any, more than anything, uh, that you can do for yourself. You know what I mean? So that's my advice to anyone that's going through, that's struggling. Check out I'mListening.org for more information. Take a minute, save a life.